probably was tripping right there, but I was just expressing how I felt at the time as a man. And, you know, I was in the wrong or I was in the wrong for proving my rights. But just take that down. I don't want that shit to, to stay in my name. And I respect that. It's not up no more. Now, what I can say about the 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 the, the OBA situation with Ad talking online with all the interviews, you, people can't don't don't blame Vlad, bro. At first, I was one of the uh, one of many to blame Vlad TV. Yo, bro, why Vlad asking these questions? Why Ab's talking like? I, listen, bro, you gotta blame Ab for that, man. A lot of this shit, you gotta hold yourself accountable for. A lot of the situations that we sit in and we try to blame other, we gotta we gotta find some accountability for ourselves too. We put ourselves in our own situation. Now, if you just get taken by mistaken identity, if you walking down the block and you got all black on and somebody else in the area were all black and I, I got cousins that sitting in jail like that right now, then I can feel for that. But you gotta you gotta you, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, you gotta take accountability for that, bro. Ab knew what he was doing when he went up Vlad. He knew the history. Everybody know the history. We seen it. Look what happened to Rollo. Rollo went up there running his mouth. Yeah, man. Own own the condominium. Own this type of apartment. Yeah, two Lambos outside next week later. What happened to him? Indictment. Yeah, and I'm not saying that the feds probably pulled that shit up in court, but that's a lot of ARAB interviews. That's a lot of shit in them interviews that I'm not I'm not gonna put out there, but y'all can go see for yourself. Listen, bro, as soon as somebody went down, don't don't criticize nobody on Instagram for putting the clips up. Tell people when they can't to go holler at them fucking bloggers and take that shit down. Yo, we got a bag, bro. Take that shit down. It ain't looking good for A right now. You need to take this shit down. At least until this shit over with. At least until it's withdrawn. Not even withdrawn. Until they close the case completely. Whereas though it can't be open again at all. But what I want to ask y'all too is... What y'all expect? What y'all expect? I told y'all the last time when I first started the first podcast, well, the last podcast, was y'all surprised? It's the feds. How many people beat federal cases? They, they conviction rate is very high, bro. They're very successful at what they do. They the feds, bro. They, these niggas build a case on you. Even if, and, and the nigga that was ratting on the whole situation, bro, listen, bro. I see it's on Instagram floating now. It's a little video. He like, yo, my lawyer, it's, she corrupted. She made me say this, that. No, nigga, you to, you told. You you open up your mouth. You was bumping your gums, nigga. You should have did all. You should have thought about all that shit before you start talking. You should have did it before you start talking. So don't try to make a little clip while you in jail and yeah, la, la, la. Hopefully, ARA get a pill, cause I don't want to see no man sit in jail. But like I said, bro. It's fucked up, and I feel like Arab image and the type of music that he made, the the gritty, the the the, the street. Nobody is ever gonna feel that type of that type of vibe in Philadelphia again. That was his own vibe. That was his own lane. Like you know how you got a nigga like PNB Rock and he sound like PNB Rock, and you got Meek, he sound like Meek, and you got Core that sound like Core, and you got Dub that sound like Dub, and you got Shady that sound like Shady. Ab was Ab, bro. And nobody is ever going to feel that vibe again. He had the streets on Smash, bro. Personally, one of my favorite mixtapes from A.R. Ad was Who Harder Than Me Too. And my little brothers argue with me every day. No, bro, this tape better. That tape, let me know what's your favorite A.R. Ad mixtape. Let me know what's your favorite A.R. Ad mixtape in the comments section, bro. Like I said, keep the nigga name alive. Niggas kept Bobby Smurda name alive. He was a sturdy nigga. He stood tall, you know. He, he probably had a lot of time to think about what he had to hold, hold himself accountable for. So, Ab, you know, he'll find what he got to hold himself accountable for. Because we all leaders at the end of the day. And he led men. You know what I mean? Let's, let's not just make this, this title all about Ab. We got to respect the other men that went down in this situation, too. Because they was riding. And they was, they was for their the gang. They was for their family. Understand, this is not just a... This is family. If you around a man every day and you would do this, that, and the third for him, if you would feed him, if you could, if you would put clothes on their back, if you would go to war, then y'all family. That's considered family. You don't go against family. So, you know, free their whole family, bro. And keep they, they all their families in y'all prayer. Keep all their family in y'all prayer until, you know, they get a pill and they, and they get to come on. But like I said, bro, I stand on what I stand on. 
I ain't like these other bloggers, bro. I'm actually a rapper. I actually met people. I actually been in real life situation with with on both sides. <laughs> like on one side that was beefing with the other side. And I was the nigga that had to come in Philly. I got dropped off in Philly in the middle of all this shit. Coming to events. All that. Me. Yeah, ain't nobody. Wasn't nobody backing me. Just me, bro. So I seen a lot. And it's a lot of stuff that I'm not going to talk on or speak about. Because I'm, I'm holding that back for a special interview. Uh, I got to take a flight out in New Orleans. And me and Supreme Bay TV. Shout out to Supreme Bay TV. Um, they covered a lot of the OVH and Trinsetta Shady beef. They covered me and Trinsetta Shady fallout. And I'm letting y'all know now that Shady is good. Other than that, I don't know. I don't know what's going on with Shady. He might resurface. He might not. But stay tuned, man, and let me know how y'all feel in the comment section about anything that I said. All Rap Con Podcast, powered by Street Rap TV. Follow me on Instagram, dub underscore the best kept secret. Follow All Rap Con on Instagram at All Rap Con, no underscores. And follow Street Rap TV. This is what it's